Dr. Babylon. Sounds like a Jamaican rap star or something. <laughs> I'm Dr. Babylon. This is from Agents of Mayhem. Uh, this is a request from Emmanuel on Patreon. Let's go. Uh, landscape page, use a pencil eraser, hit pause if I go too fast. Sinister looking dude. Like an android type. So, start with I. Center point to my page about here. Come up over to the left because his other eye is right eye is covered. So we'll just start with the left one. So we go up, diagonal. Bring it to kind of dips down and then back up. And then we have some eyelashes on the end. Right, and then bottom eyelid line comes down this way, cross in towards the center, and there's some eyelashes on the corner right there as well. It looks like he's looking down, so we got like just like the iris down there, and then the pupil. Will we, what will we do, Zoe? We'll go. We go like looking maybe more at us rather than down. So we go put it there coming down from the bottom. So we have an eyelid line just coming across here. And then a bags underneath his eyes. So he's frowning pretty heavily for his eyebrow, right? So this kind of curves around this way and twitches the eyelid line here and then your eyebrow goes up this way it's kind of got some spikes on it and it sticks up real spiky here it's got some lines that go down this way and then this comes down to the front like that So his nose then, you can't see the other eye, right? You can see it like a little bit of his frown, I guess. You can see like this curve around here. And then something like across the bridge of his nose. But that's all really. So then he's got this skinny sort of bridge of the nose here. Curves down like so. Same on the other side. that and then at the bottom we've got like the nostrils and the tip of the nose curves across there and then the skin along the outside of his nose here like that there might be like a light sort of area here darken up the nostrils there so his mouth then it's kind of flat but he's smiling right so it's kind of so we start underneath the pupil here kind of like curves up at first and then it goes fairly flat and then curves up in the corner here again right so his chin pretty square just there His jaw then, he's got quite a long face, so his jaw comes up like so. His jaw comes out this way. And then it kind of curves around the jawbone there. And then here, it goes up this way. This will go out and around like this can't see that on this side so we have some mouth lines like coming around this way they're kind of like wrinkles and stuff he's got like a very severe looking sort of face like going this way and then some lines underneath his chin he doesn't have a bottom lip but there's like a line just here for the bottom lip I guess and then that sort of thing <laughs> Do -do 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 -do. 
do that. Okay, so big round egg head. So it goes up around here. Down there. If you wanted to copy go the whole way through, you can and erase the lines afterwards. But we can't really see anything here, so you can just see like the lines for his temple, top of his head and stuff. Like that. So we can just see his ear. Sort of sticking out. And then sort of ear lines inside like that weird okay so we've got like this eye thing here right so it goes this way and then like around the back of his head here okay and then it comes across the front down in and then it goes on to his cheek here and around the jaw to there somewhere. And then we have another section that goes down and then goes around his head back to there. And then we have another layer there. If you want to make this like a little bit three dimensional looking optional of course you can just do an edge line coming down like so and something similar here as well sorry now if you can hear shouting in the background the kids are going crazy lines like so and then he's got like a red Eye line there comes down there across down to there and that's like glowing red inside. Okay, so his neck, so his neck just like comes down this way. It's like his collar, right? So it comes down on like this. And the bits of the collar that we can see just go like right underneath his chin. Around to there. And like a neck muscle line there. So then he's wearing like a collar cloak. Shoulder and a staff, right? <clears throat> so this comes out this way first and then curves down. And this is just normal, sort of. He's got a staff over this, but we'll just get the shoulder in the right place, sort of, first, all right, like that. And then there's all these sort of fold lines that like go around his like shoulder all this way, like that, right. And then he's got some lines down the middle. All right, like so. And then he's got like a robot type thing over here. So like a big spike. And it's got like some layers to it. Another line going that way. And there's like some golden patterns or something here, so I'll just do them kind of random. If you want to copy them exactly, you can. But I think that's kind of what they look like, really. And let's see. All right, the staff, Sue. It's kind of this spike, right? So it's got a square end here. And then it goes down. 
this way longer on this side because then it changes direction down to there and then this comes out down like so okay and i'll just erase this line right and then the back of the staff kind of sticks out this way and then curves down like so and then we have another line here and then curves down that way and then the staff seems to have like some edge lines and things here and some of like this pattern on the staff some up here as well and these are look like they glow red right. I think that's everything that's how to draw Dr. Babylon from something mayhem what is it called agents of mayhem hope it's helpful thanks for the request Emmanuel just a little line there and stuff anyone else with unusual requests maybe from things I don't normally draw head over to Patreon or even if it is stuff I do draw like Naruto characters that I haven't drawn or you have an idea that you'd like me to draw you can even send me the image and I'll get right on it thanks for watching see you in the next one bye